Hey guys, Cookatrol16 here and welcome back to another Forza Font video. This weekend it's called Summertime Blues where you'll be in the chance of winning 150,000 credits, 95,000 XP, free wheel spins and the Porsche 959. Please give this video a massive thumbs up if you do enjoy it and let me know in the comments section below if this helps you out. Now if you can see at the beginning of this video all the challenges say that they are completed because I've been on Forza already this morning and completed all these challenges. So if you want all the information on how to do it and how to get each reward then stay tuned. And also my gamer tag will be featured throughout the video so you can check out my storefront for tunes and designs that you can happily go and download. The first challenge is called Walk in the Park, where you've got to get 3 stars on the Surface Park Danger sign to receive 150,000 credits. Now you will find this just near the festival site and all you've got to do is just get 3 stars on this one danger sign and then you'll easily receive the 150,000 credits. Now as you can see in this clip, it did take me a lot of tries before I actually finally got over 450. Now if you're doing it in feet, that's the amount that you've got to get. So you've got to get 450 feet or more and then you'll win the 3 stars and then you'll win the 150,000 credits. Now my advice to you is to always have Wii wind on and pick a fast car like the Ford GT Horizon Edition or the Sesto Elemento. Both of these cars work but if you have another car that is really quick then it maybe could work. So all you've got to do is just get 3 stars on this one danger sign which is in Surface Paradise and then you'll simply receive the 150,000 credits. So as you saw there I finally hit it with 459 feet and that got me the 3 stars and the 150,000 credits. So if you do 3 stars and you get more than 450 if you're doing it in feet then you'll simply receive the 150,000 credits. The next challenge is called Beach Bum where you've got to perform 10 ultimate air skills to earn 95,000 XP. Now I found this an easier place to go just next to the drag strip in the hilly sandy area and then all you've got to do is just drive over hills in a really fast car and that'll simply get you the ultimate air skills. So you've got to perform 10 of these and then you'll simply earn your 95,000 XP. Now there is other areas where you can do this but I find it an easier place just to go in the hilly section just about where the drag strip is. And that's how you get the 95,000 XP. The next challenge is called Sam Pale, where you've got to complete a bucket list challenge that ends in Surface Paradise to win free wheel spins. Now you can choose any bucket list challenge you want to, but it has to make sure that it ends in Surface Paradise, otherwise it won't get you the free wheel spins if it's not ended in Surface Paradise. So all you've got to do is just complete any bucket list challenge you want to that ends in Surface Paradise and then you'll simply win the free wheel spins. Now I've got a bucket list challenge up that you can use if you want to. It's located in West Point Tower and it's called Hashtag Forzathon. Now you have to use the Ford GT Horizon Edition and you have to get to the destination in 1 minute 20 seconds or under and then that will happily make you complete it and then you'll get the free wheel spins and it will also land in Surface Paradise. But like I said, you can do any bucket list challenge you want to, it just has to make sure that it ends in Surface Paradise. Now if you guys haven't got bucket list challenges unlocked, then you can go in a co-op campaign session with one of your friends and they can blueprint you a bucket list challenge and they can set one up. But if you do that, you have to make sure that you have to get to the destination in the same time, which will then have to combine your times together and then you'll simply get to the destination in that time. So you've got to make sure that you complete a bucket list challenge that ends in Surface Paradise and then that'll simply receive and get you the free wheel spins.
So yeah guys, that's my bucket list right there. You can go and use it if you really want to. It's located in West Point Tower and it's called Forzafon where you'll use the 4 GT Horizon Edition and you've got to get to the destination in 1 minute 20 seconds or under. So if you complete a bucket list challenge that ends in Surface Paradise then you'll simply receive your free wheel spins. The final challenge is called Seashore Series where you've got to win the championship to receive the Porsche 959. Now you can blueprint any championship you want to, it doesn't say a specific card that you have to do it in but all you've got to do is win that championship and then you'll simply receive the Porsche 959. Now I have already won this championship but I'm just showing you the final two races of the championship of me doing one of the races and then me winning the Porsche 959. So all you've got to do is you win the championship and then you will simply receive the car. So you can either decide to win all three races by coming first place and now winning the championship series or you can do it the way that I did it and come first place in the first two races and then you can come third place in the last race and that'll simply still win you the championship and that'll still get you the car but my advice to you is to make sure you win every race so get a really quick car that's really good for that championship so you can win it and then you can receive the Porsche 959. So that's the second race done where I come first place. Now let's jump straight into the last race where I win the car and I show you the car itself. There will be a tune and design out for the Porsche 959 later so make sure you check out my storefront where you'll be able to use it and download it and you can use the tune and design for this car. So guys this is the final race of the championship and then after this I will show you the Porsche 959 and I will show you every bit about the car. Now if you guys remember in the previous Forzathon we actually had the chance to win the Porsche 959 before so you might already have one of these cars so you might have two in total. I have two of these cars now and I won't be selling both of them but I will be releasing a tune and design out for the one I just win today. My mate will probably be releasing a tuning design out for this car as well later. I will leave his game tag in the description below so you can go check out his storefront where he has tunes and designs for his cars up as well. And I will also leave his YouTube channel in the description below so you can go check out his YouTube channel because he does photo fun videos and he sometimes does live videos as well. 
as you saw there guys I come third place in that race and I'm still won the championship because I came first place in the first race first place in the second race and then third place in the third race and that won me the championship I think this is starting to get unfair so before this video ends I'm just going to quickly show you the Porsche 959 the car that I have now won So there we go guys, we've won the car, let's get it out and let's see just what it's like. Now I already know what this car is like because I've had two of these so I've drove it before and I've got to say it's a really nice car. It comes as a stock A class but I think you can do it to a top S2, maybe an X, I'm not too sure. So guys, that is this weekend's Falls of done. That's everything you need to know, all the details of how to win each reward and how to do all the challenges. Please like, comment and subscribe if you enjoyed this video and I will see you all in the next one.